Hey guys, welcome to an updated video tutorial on the plugin minigames party. So you may have seen this on the minigames party server, or you may, may have seen my previous tutorial, but this is an updated one because he's changed a few bits and uh, added some more commands. So let's set the lobby to begin with, so MP set lobby, set the global lobby. And now we need to actually create it, so uh, the developer suggests you fly really high uh, away from any scenery or mountains. Uh, before doing this, uh, letting chunks load so there is less lag. So about here, what, what height are we at? Uh, y, Z, 140, let's go to 150. Right, so the command, if you do MP, shows you all the commands. But we're going to want to do uh, forward slash MP setup. So uh, at the moment I've got um, 3 gigabytes of RAM on the server just in case. So MP setup and below me it will create... Um, all the platforms and uh, whatnot. So here we go, I've done it. Uh, it will probably lag out the server, but hopefully it won't crash the server. So as you can see, all of the different platforms have been created. Um, I did forward slash stop lag before, because uh, I had to do it a second time and it worked, so I suggest you do that. Um, and now let's create a join sign, so this is very simple. You need to use one line and you type party in square brackets and there we go so I'm gonna grab some people and let's showcase what the games do so before we start you may want to set up the course for um, this death run so uh, just make your own course you have to go from one side to the other so I'm gonna paste some of these in hopefully they'll be the correct correct length let's right click the sign and see which all we're on jump and run first so uh, it starts in a few seconds uh, we have a certain amount of time and uh, ooh, come on oh no so if you fall down you will get teleported back and I am being pretty useless at this uh, there we go so if the time runs out um, you lose you can set the times in the config this has 50 seconds um, and you have to get to the other side so uh, when you step on a fresh plate you get teleported back and it disappears so if I hit that one I will disappear. So this is probably the hardest uh, of all. Right, <laughs> just, just just run forwards, it'll be easier. Nope, not today. Uh, let me just go over here. Come on. Right, here we go. And jump, come on, nearly. No, oh, so close, I was so close. Right, uh... If I uh, just cheat my way there, right, so like so, if I get to the other end, um, we win, but that's because we haven't set um, spawn point, so uh, you can use double jump in this one, and uh, you have to hit people off, so just, uh, you get a medium slapper, knock back five, you have to knock people off, so off you go Kyle, off you pop, come on. There we go, and he's gone. So I won that. All oh, the smoke monster. Many of you should know this. If you don't, basically it spawns those smoke particles, and you have to avoid them. So by running, uh, I think I won that. This one, um, the floor changes colour from um, yellow to orange to red. Uh, the red is most likely to uh, just vanish. Uh, it's best to stay on the white and the yellow. So uh, basically, it's just luck. Oh, that was unlucky. Uh, this one, I, I'm pro at this, um, colour match, you should know this from my tutorial, uh, purple, 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 right here's purple, <sighs> that was lucky, um, where are we going to go next, it's green, so uh, you're watching this on Monday the 27th, no 28th, oh, sign, sign, no, okay, and uh, yesterday I uploaded my first uh, mod tutorial, so subscribe for that, and there'll be another on Sunday. So this one's quite interesting, uh, behind where you walk, um, blocks are deleted, you can't actually jump on this, uh, which is makes it even harder, so I'm going to try and get Kyle. So actually I can cut him off, I can cut him off, he he'll never know, he'll never know. Ooh, how did that happen? Okay, uh, right. just keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running, uh, I don't know how he got across, oh he must have got in one of these cross sections. Uh, let's get try and go across. No, oh, this is precarious. Oh my gosh, this is precarious. 
Um, I might in fact be stuck on the outer ring. Uh, I might try and head to the middle. Ooh, no! <laughs> okay, so, whoa, lag. Whoa, 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 what was that all about? Okay, so uh, this one is one in the gun, or chamber. There we go. And now we're on chicken tags, so you probably know this. Pass the chicken onto the other... Oh, I've got the chicken! Have the chicken! So when you get a chicken on your head, you have to give it to the other person. And after a minute, you die. So I sped it up due to this. Uh, sheep will start to spawn. Oh, there we go. And now we're on split. So we already had that one. So uh, let's go. One second. Right. Uh, why am I doing that? Come on. Oh, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. Come on. Come on. Nope. Oh, I'm useless. <laughs> Okay, so there we go. If you do MP leave, um, that is the end of the minigame. And I'm going to show you how you can edit some stuff now in the config and in-game. Here we are in the config, and uh, as expected, you can edit some text. You can edit um, coins and rewards. And finally, down here, you can have a look at all the spawn locations. So um, we'll have a look at that in-game afterwards. Uh, that's quite interesting because you can set different start and finish points depending on uh, if you've made custom pa maps or not. So uh, here we go. Uh, this is very simple. Uh, just strings uh, of what they say in chat. So you can edit that if you wish, but you don't have to. Uh, this is interesting. The shop, you can change prices, maybe if you want them to be difficult to get or hard. Uh, because donators, you can give them the permission to have double it, the experience, which is also very interesting. Uh, you can have scoreboards, negative, true, yes, no, and you can change how long each minigame is for, so maybe 45 seconds if you think a minute's too long. Uh, item rewards, you can change this, uh, and to diamonds. Max players, use economy, uh, if you got vault or an economy plugin, you could set that to true. You can set that to true as well. Just whatever you want. Minimum players one, that's useful for me for showcasing it. And minimum max reward. So uh, you can set this. So that is everything really um, in the config. So we're going to look at changing some locations in game now. If you have forgotten where you set up um, all the different platforms, you can do MP setup point and it will teleport you onto it, which is a really nice command. Uh, and we just fell through. So the final thing that I need to go through with you is uh, the component part. So this may sound complicated, but it's really not. So if you do MP, uh, you can see the command right at the bottom. Um, so let's do MP set component. Um, there we go. Um, what mini game should we choose? Oh, let's have let's list them. Um, death run. Uh, is that what it's called? No, it's called jump and run. So set component, jump and run, and uh, there's a variety to choose from. So let's uh, change our speed and find it. So here it is. So this is our jump and run. You may remember we built it. And uh, there's a variety of things you can change. So you can add spectator points for people who die. Uh, you can add um, other bits and bobs. So um, let me have a look. So there is spawns, lobby, spectator lobby, and finish. So let's do spectator lobby first. So jump for run spectator lobby, like so. Uh, you can add a spawn in a different place. For example, uh, maybe here instead. For some reason, I don't know. Just just depends what what your map's like. Because you can you could completely change it really um, with these. So this is a really nice uh, addition. So set the spawn. And you can obviously change the finish, which is uh, one of the main things. So here we go. We're going to go over here. Uh, you could potentially have a diamond staircase of winningness, which people have to climb up to get to the yellow block of winners. And uh, this would be your finish. So when they get up here, they win. So that's quite interesting. So they know they have to jump, run up there afterwards. So that's basically the whole plugin. If you've got any questions, um, feel free to comment down below. If you've got any errors, it's
probably best to uh, create a ticket and uh, I'm sure the developer will be happy to help you out. Um, and that's all folks, uh, I'll see you on the Wednesday episode which is going to be, um, what's it going to be, I'm not sure, um, oh yeah, Cookie Monster, yes, so watch out for that on Wednesday, adios. Thanks for watching this tutorial guys, why not click one of the other videos on the left or the right to check out some of my other plugins that I reviewed. As always, subscribe, like and comment, cheers.